So, last time you studied these questions. Tell me the answers. Can the man send marriage proposal to a lady who already has a pending proposal for another man? Hadith 3245, Sarah and Nisai. No, he cannot. Your sound is not clear. Your sound is not audible. Now? Yes, now tell me. Hadith 3245, Asanan and Nisai, no, he cannot unless the previous man gave up the idea or give him the permission. If a lady gets a marriage proposal from a man who is either not suitable for her or either he is a bad person, can you suggest the lady to reject the proposal? Hadith 3246, Salan in Nisai, yes. Ask her or to reject the proposal. Your sound is not good today. Can a father propose or suggest a person to marry his daughter if the father thinks that person is suitable for his daughter? Yes, he can. Oh, Bismillah, Today we will study from the book Sahih Al Bukhari. So read this and this twenty six eighty five. Narrated Obedullah bin Abdullah bin. How do you ask the people of the scriptures? Your sound is not good today. To, uh, your book, Quran, which was. Tija Muslim, can you hear us? Okay, Miss Ho, read this. Narrated of Ubedullah bin Abdullah bin Utba ibn Abbas Talanha said, O oh, Assembly of Muslim, how do you ask the people of the scriptures though you, your book, the Quran, which was revealed to his Prophet is the most recent information from Allah and you recite it, the Quran that, that has not been destroyed distort Allah has informed you that the people of the scriptures this the distort distort and changed what was revealed to them with their own hands and they said as regards their changed scriptures this is from Allah in order to get some worldly benefit thereby Ibn Abbas added isn't the knowledge revealed to you sufficient to prevent you from asking them by Allah I have never seen any one of them asking you Muslims about what has been revealed to you so basically the Jews and Christians have made changes to their holy books so they claim that this is from God, but actually this is their own wordings. So their books are not in their original forms. Miss Khatija Muslim, read this one. Narrated. 
and Numan ibn Bashir radiyallahu anhum. The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, the example of the person abiding by Allah's order and limit, or the one who abides by the limits and regulation prescribed by Allah, in comparison to the one who do wrong and violates Allah's limit, order is like an example of drawing lots for seats in a boat. Some of them get seats in the upper path while the other in the lower path. Those in the lower path have to pass by those in the upper one to get water, and that troubles the letter. One of them, that is the people in the lower path, took an axe and started making a hole in the bottom of the boat. The people of the upper path came and asked him, saying, what is, what is wrong with you? He replied, you have, been you have been troubled much by me, coming up to you, and I have to get water. Now, if they prevent him from doing that, they will save him and themselves. But if they leave him to do what he wants, they will destroy him and themselves. So this is an example that a boat which has two floors, upper part and bottom part. So in bottom, people make the hole in it to get water. The whole ship will sink. Same in the parable of the good people and bad people. If good people does not stop the bad people from committing sins, everyone will be perished. Everyone will be destroyed. <clears throat> so here we can write these questions. What if good people don't try to stop the bad people from doing bad things. What if the good people don't try to What if the good people don't try to stop the bad people? Let me write it again. What if the bad, sorry, good people don't try to stop the bad people from doing bad things. So in the answer you will write according to the Hadith 26, 86, of Sahih al-Bukhari everyone will perish everyone, everyone will, will perish or you can also write destroyed P-E-R-I-S-H perished or destroyed everyone including the good people will be destroyed so basically the good people will also slowly slowly become the bad people
Miss Ho, repeat the question and the answer. What if good people don't try to stop the bad people from doing bad things? 2686 of Sahil Bukhari, everyone will be perished or destroyed. Now read the next hadith. Narrated Ummul Ala that when the Ansar viewed lots as to which, which of the immigrants should be built with which of the Ansar the name of Uthman bin Mazan came out to be in their lot. Um Al Ala further said, Usman stayed with us and we nursed him when he when he got sick but he did he died. We we storied it him in his cloth and Allah's messenger sallallahu alayhi wa came to our house and I said addressing the dead Usman O Abu Asahib may Allah be merciful to you I testify that Allah has blessed you the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said to me how do you know that Allah has blessed him I replied, I do not, I do not, I do not know. Oh, Allah's messenger, may, may my parents be sacrificed for you. Allah's messenger, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, said, as regards Usman by Allah, he has died and I really wish him every good yet by, by Allah, although I am Allah's messenger. I do not know what what will be done to him. Umal Allah, aided by Allah, I I shall never attest the pity of anybody after him. And what what Allah's messenger, sallallahu alaihi wasallam, said made made me said. Umal Allah further said once I slept. And saw in a dream a flowing stream for Usman. So I went to Allah's Messenger وسلم, and told him about it. He said that is the symbol of his good deeds. So we have two things in this hadith. First thing, sometimes there are things which cannot be divided or which cannot be shared. So to get that thing or to distribute to distribute that thing we can drew lots to see who will get that thing second thing we does not know we don't know what will happen to any person sometimes we may see a person is very good but actually in his next life he has a punishment from allah and sometimes we may dislike a person but in next life allah reward him so we can't be sure about anyone. We don't know what will happen to anyone after his death. Miss Khatija. Narrated Aisha radiallahu anha. Whenever a last messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam intended to go on a journey, he used to draw lots among his wives and would take with him the one on whom the lot fell. He also used to fix for every one of his wives a day and a night. But Saud went to Zama gave her day and night to Aisha, the wife of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, intending thereby to please the last messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. So we have two things again. First thing is about drawing lots to give someone something. Yes, we can draw lots to give someone something which can't be And second thing, when any person has more than one wife, he should give each wife one day and one night. So everyone should have equal turn. Miss Hoor. 
narrated abdul abu huraira radhiyallahu ta'ala anha allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wasallam said if can you hear me yes narrated abu huraira radhiyallahu ta'ala anha anhu bail for but ke liye anhu hota hai okay narrated abdu narrated abu huraira radhiyallahu ta'ala anhu Allah's Messenger sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "If the people knew what is the reward of pronouncing the azan ka call for the salah prayers and of being in the first row in the congregational prayer, and if they found no other way to get this privilege except by casting lots." they would certainly cast lots for it if they knew the reward of the noon prayer they would raise for it and if they knew the reward of the morning fajr and isha late evening sala prayers they would present themselves for the sala prayers even if they had to crawl to reach there So this means there is a great reward from Allah Almighty for giving azan and for praying in the first row of the congregational salah. So everyone should try to in pray the salah in the first row. This this is for men. And the other question which is here: Can we draw lots? Or can we cast lots to distribute or for distribution? Can we cast the Lords for distribution. So the question is, can we cast the lords for distribution? You can also say, can we draw the lords for distribution according to Hadith 2689? Yes, we can. According to Hadith 2689 of Sahih al Bukhari, yes, we can. Miss Khatija Muslim repeat question and the answer. Can we cast the lot for distribution? According to Hadith 2689 of Sahih al-Bukhari. Yes, we can. Now read this. The Book of Peacemaking or Reconciliation. One, chapter. What has been said regarding reconciliation between the people? And the statement of Allah, Jalla Jalal, Lahu, there is no good in most of their secret talks, save in in who are the sadaqa, charity in Allah's cause, or maruf, Islamic monotheism, and all the good and righteous deed which Allah has ordained, or conciliation between mankind, and he who does this, seeking the good pleasure of Allah, we shall give him a great reward, and the good of the ruler to the places where disputes arise, to bring about a reconciliation between people through their companions. Read the next one. Narrated Sahil Bun Sahil Bun Sad. There were the, there was a dispute among the people of the tribe of Banu Amr Bun Auf. 
the Prophet وسلم, went to them along with some of his companions in order to make peace between them. The time for the Salah prayer became due, but the Prophet وسلم, did not turn up. Bilal pronounced the Hadha for Salah, for the Salah prayer, but the Prophet وسلم, did not turn up. So Bilal went to Abu Bakri and said, the time for Salah prayer is due and the Prophet is, وسلم, is detained. Would you lead the people in the Salah? Will you lead the people in the Salah prayer? Abu Bakri replied, yes, if you wish. So Bilal pronounced the Iqama of the Salah prayer and Abu Bakri went ahead to lead the Salah. But the Prophet وسلم, came walking among the row till he joined the first row. The people started clapping and they clapped too much. And Abu Bakri used and Abu Bakri used not to look either and think either and think either in the solar prayer but he turned around and saw the Prophet standing behind him. The Prophet beckoned him with his hand to keep on offering solar prayer where he was. So Abu Bakri, Abu Bakri raised his hand and praised Allah and then retreated till he came into the first row. And the Prophet went ahead and led the people in the solar prayer. When the Prophet finished the solar prayer, he turned towards the people and said, Oh, people, when something happens to you during the solar prayer, you start clapping. In fact, clapping is permissible for women only. If something happens to one of you in his solar prayer, he should say, SubhanAllah, glorified be to Allah. For whosoever here, for whosoever hears him saying so would direct his attention towards him. Oh, Abu Bakri, what prevented you from leading the people in the solar prayer when I beckoned to you to continue? Abu Bakri replied, it did not befit the son of Abu Kuhafa to lead the solar prayer in front of the prophet. So, so we have two things here. What shall the people do if the imam is late for the congregational salah what shall the people do if the If the Imam is late for the congregational solah, what shall the people do? If the Imam is late for the congregational salah. According to Hadith 2690 of Sahih Al Bukhari, then any good person should come forward and lead the Salah. I will repeat the answer. According to Hadith 46 deity then any good person shall come forward and lead the sala. Ms. Hur, repeat the question and the answer. 
what shall the people do if the imam is late for congregational salah 2690 of sahih al bukhari then any good person shall come forward and lead the salah now next question that you all need to write what shall the people do if imam if imam makes a mistake during the salah What shall the people do if Iba makes a mistake during the Salah? According to Hadith 26.90 The men should say Subhan Allah and the woman can clap. Yes. And the woman can clap to make the above realize his mistake. I will repeat according to the Hadith 26 deity the men should say Subhad Allah and the woman can clap speak the Ibab realize his mistake. Miss Khatija Muslim, repeat the question and the answer. What shall, what shall the people do if Imam makes a mistake during the Salah? According to Hadith 2690 of Sahih al bukhari the man should say subhanallah and the woman can clap to make the imam realize his mistake we will stop here if any of you has any questions you can ask me see you all next time inshallah